Oh yeah, it's definitely snowing now. <laughs> I can see it bouncing off the hood. And it's definitely coming inside. Everyone is staring. Yeah, they're like, look Who at- are these crazy people I from know. Michigan? <laughs> guys welcome back to the channel and this one's gonna be a little different because we're at Pikes Peak we just got this thing dyno tuned the other day it's making great power we're like we got to go climb Pikes Peak we did it a couple days ago but it was only open for six miles which was kind of a bummer today it's open for the first 13 so it's twice as much as we did still can't get all the way to the top because of snowpack which I'm sure we'll see when we get up there but yeah you can just follow along with us and you can see what we see. This place is really cool. I am excited to see like the next seven miles that we didn't get to do. Yeah. We only got to go basically to the visitor center at kind of the base, like up yeah. the driveway a little bit. So should be pretty cool. The scenery out here is just insane. Hopefully yeah. this rain clears up. Yeah, that little tease we had the other day of the first six miles. It's like, we got to come back. I'm excited to do the next part. We should have looked up the race course, like where the start finish line is. Well, they might be painted on the ground. I don't know. It's probably on this map, but I definitely can't look at it right now. That's fine. This thing echoes against the canyon. It's so cool. It's like a tunnel without a tunnel, but yeah. you get the nice, the nice echo. Yeah, this thing does wrap pretty good. Sounds so good. You just roll into it and it just makes happy sounds. It'd be near as much fun in an SUV. Definitely not. No, this thing is way fun. I know, and you don't even have to like beat on it. You just cruise it, and it's still fun. Six hundred feet. Oh, now we're getting to the switchbacks too. That's yeah, so the start of the race course. What about right there? Yeah. You gotta have some balls to race this. Yeah. Like wide open. Especially back when like the top used to be dirt. Like I can't imagine like no dropping <laughs> off. Because now you have to have tires that work on pavement and dirt, like... Yeah. Halfway picnic ground. It's gorgeous.
like, I mean, that, you screw up like on your braking. Right now. Yeah, you're just launching. Mile 10. Look at that tree. It's like all busted up. Must have been from the snow. I can see why you would want to race him, but I can also <laughs> see that I would be terrified. Yeah. So. It is. Now we're like really climbing. Yeah, we that Oh my god, yeah. We'll focus on driving a little bit. <laughs> Playground. Not marked out on here. Oh, it's in the switchback. Oh, it's like the beginning of the switchback. Mile 16. Oh, uh, so we're not going to get there? I think that's right where we have to turn around. No, we have to turn around 13. Oh my god, look at this. It's just straight off. Oh. <laughs> Pedestrian crossing? Yeah, the whole parking area. Yeah. falling off. <laughs> it does not have the snappiness that it normally does. Oh, and they did climb Kana. That was when they added the turbos to make up for the elevation. I don't think it would be fun doing it in a Yukon or a Suburban or whatever the boat is in front of us. Definitely not. It's like cruising your living room couch home. <laughs> Like, comfortable, not really much fun. Charger. Yeah. <laughs> He's pointing out the car. Nice. I guess we're in the clouds when it's raining. <laughs> yeah, that's true. We'll probably roll up through. I think we're almost to the top. to 11,000. It's like snowing. It is. Yeah. We got summer tires. <laughs> we'll be good. High performance summer tires near the wear bars. Who would have thought in May? <laughs> Definitely coming inside. Everyone is staring. Yeah, they're like, look at these crazy people. I know. <laughs> It's cool to bring a 79 Trans Am up here, but they were driving cars up here in what, like the 30s? Yeah. Like, 
what, like 12 horsepower? Can you imagine? Carburetor. Well, in those old ones, you could like adjust the fuel mixture from like a lever in the cab. But just chugging along. That is just gorgeous up yeah, here. Yeah, it is. Is this where we have to stop? I'm not sure. It doesn't look like it. All right, off into the snow. I guess. I guess I should wait for that. Why not go matter? Oh my god. Mile 13. This is insane. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> that? Oh, I thought it was small enough we could straddle it. I was wrong. That's all the higher we go. Oh, look at it up there. You can see the guardrail up there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dang. That is crazy. Looks like the 51. They're like monster truck and this thing. They're like, it's so cool because it's just so different compared to everything else on the road. All right, back down we go. Oh. Don't see any of these on the road anymore. <laughs> no, you don't. I have a 72. Nice. nice. Very cool. We brought it out here. We're like, we got to run pike speed with it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We don't, can't go all the way up, yeah. but it was still a lot of fun. We went as far as we could, at least. Yeah. <laughs> no. Love them. They're fun cars. Yeah. I love mine. I and know what's funny is, is that being as old as it is, I've got a couple of old, old you know, from the 60s, like 70s. It's the only one that drives like a modern car. Yeah. yeah. You know, it really feels like, you know, yeah, this is suspension her and all that. It's her daily driver. She puts like 10,000 yeah. miles a year on it. Yeah. It drives beautifully. Like, I love this thing. Yeah, well, love seeing them. <laughs> Glad to keep it alive. Exactly. Thank you. Yeah. Funny. We had this car at like 13,000 feet, she said. Yeah, we're like just under 13,000. Doing good. The six speed's really nice for us. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Makes it a lot. It just, yeah, it's always in the gear you want. Like, it's not hunting going up and coming down. I'm just rolling second. Do I don't know, he's doing more aerobics or something. I don't know. What a weird guy. How is he not freezing? I don't know. And he was lifting barbells up at the top. I mean, I guess I can well have a view while you're working out. I don't know. I don't know. Aerobics. Aerobics? See, that's the weird one, a Robux. It's aerobics. I guess we could have stopped at this one. They're all just so pretty. I know, it is gorgeous. Oh, this is the one that had the big drop on. Wow. Okay. 
hitting. Just wow. <laughs> just that over there. Yeah. It's just beautiful. Wait the view. Everyone loves this car. <laughs> you can see everybody staring. <laughs> yeah. It's really funny. Time guys, let's go. I'm tired of snow and winter. That was the exact wrong time to upshift. <laughs> Before I switch back. This is just such a cool drive. It really is. Every part of it is just absolutely breathtaking. I know. I know. What better soundtrack do you need? Right. This car does handle pretty well. For now, really have just springs and shocks and tires, like stock bushings. I haven't even changed them. Like, it's pretty nice. nice. Yeah. yeah. Like, it's a good, it's a good handling car that doesn't beat you up. Like, it's not gonna handle like a new car, but you can have a lot of fun with it. Yeah. And it never sneaks up on it either. Like, it's super predictable. go fast. <laughs> I don't know why, but I'm like, like, I can't go fast, but I want to. It's like, I'm done with the cruising portion. Like, 
Like, put a timer on me. Let's go. And I know that's a bad idea. It's like 30 some degrees out. This thing has summer tires. Yeah, these tires do not look good to all. That's up there in the parking lot. <laughs> I feel like that might be frowned upon. Maybe. No, but Lady Ranger seems very nice, though. <laughs> she yeah. got a lot of. I know, the Ranger is really cool. She's telling us all sorts of cool stuff. It's funny that she saw the car last time yeah. <laughs> and then was happy that we came back and we got to go further. She's like, you made it further this time. <laughs> Yeah. That last little bit was. I know, but now I just want to do the rest. Oh, like it was such a tease standing there, you can see the guardrails way up high. You can see the switchbacks. It's like, take a video of that. Yeah, I don't know if I really would have showed up. All right, well that was 13 miles of Pikes Peak. It is just gorgeous, as you saw. This thing was so much fun. It did great, except the wipers. Now, no wipers, but... Well, I, my pain of driving it hard. <laughs> 70s GM electronics. Get wipers sometimes. Yeah, it'll climb to 13,000 feet and be perfectly happy, <laughs> break the tires loose, just cruise like nothing. But we can't get wipers on the way back now. They work on the way up, they don't work on the way down. But, uh, this was awesome. I, I hope you enjoyed this little thing, kind of like, just riding with us and seeing it as we see it because this is cool and you need to come here if you've never done it yeah. we're gonna come back when it's fully open like there's this whole question we have to see those switchbacks i want to see the devil's playground where ken block hung it off the side like i have got to drive that in this car i'm not going to do that i not <laughs> anything near that i just want to cruise through it it's, it's, it's a cool piece so of history yeah. yeah it's awesome being here it's just so pretty like everywhere just you're in awe.